friends, it's been so long. I'm so sorry. Um, hi, hello, how are you? It's literally been like months. Um, I'll get into it, I'll get into it, but I just need to rinse out my little athletic greens cup. So just, just bear with me for a second. You guys saw me. It was like five months ago, and in the last five months, I honestly, it's been wild. It's been wild. So many things have happened. I feel like I'm a different person, which I mean, is I think a good thing. Um, just so much has happened. Um, traveled a lot, which was really fun. We went to, where did we even go? We went to Disneyland. We went to, Oh my gosh, I literally can't even remember. It's too early on a Monday. Oh my gosh, where did we go? We went to Disneyland, we went to Miami, we went to Vegas, we went to the Bahamas, we went to Miami and Disneyland again. And I think that's it. Yeah, it's been good, it's been good. Things have been exciting. Um, we did say goodbye to our little girl, Tika, our little doggy, which was really sad. That was in April and that really, that was really sad. Sad. I'm still sad. I'm still getting really sad about it, but I'm definitely feeling better. Um, we got a puppy. Yeah, I know a lot. Um, and we're also moving. We oh shoot, we bought a townhouse, so we are literally moving in a month, which is crazy. I'm not prepared, but yeah, we're also going to a Soyuz this week so yeah things have been crazy things have been crazy i feel like i to give you a bit of background with what's going on with our agency we literally went from i feel like i'm just rambling but i feel like i just need to like talk and get out my my thoughts and my feelings um what was i talking about what was I talking about? Oh, the agency. Um, yeah, so that has been going really well, which is awesome. Um, we literally went from two employees to six. No, no, no. Two, like, people on the team, like, literally just me and Haley, um, to us two, to a team of six in six months, which is wild. Um, that's been crazy. But... Yeah, it's been good. It's been really busy, but it's been good. Um, I'm just making some coffee, so I'll do that and continue with the story. A little catch up time, it's so fun. My favorite Nespresso pod, I feel like my favorite Nespresso coffee, if you're like wanting to get an espresso is Stormio. It is very strong, but it's, it's so good. Okay, so um, what else has been going on? It's I started working with a high performance coach a couple months ago. Um, I was honestly just not feeling, <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm gonna sound like that um, Kylie Jenner video where she's like, I'm just I'm not feeling like myself. I'm feeling like myself again, um, but it's true. I did not feel like myself for a hot minute. Um, there was just so much going on. I feel like I didn't have time to like think and process all of the change that was happening in my life which it's yeah now i'm kind of i'm feeling better like i said i was working i'm working with a coach and um by the way i'm using the laneige lip glowy balm it's literally like the lip sleeping mask but in a tube which is really great for travel and like when you're out and about because you don't want to put your nail like your dirty nails in the tub really good um Yes, so I'm working with a coach and he's just helping me with like my habits and um, th things to make me perform better. Cause you know, when I was working, I was noticing that I just like, could not focus. I was just so overwhelmed and stressed. 
that I could not focus. So now I have things in place to help keep me on track, keep me feeling good. So that is great. Um, yeah, I can talk a bit more about like what I'm doing with my coach if you guys are interested. Um, but just like my routine. So I have like a habit tracker and focusing on my goals. Just like, like I said, things to keep me um, feeling good because before I would like have a bad day and I would just like forget that meditating helps me and reading helps me or whatever it may be. So now I have like all of these things to kind of prevent, help prevent me from feeling overwhelmed, but also like, oh, I just got rudely interrupted by a phone call. That's fine. Um, I forgot what I was talking about. I think I was talking about my coach but anyways yeah i've been working on my routines i've been a really good routine i also have a online fitness trainer which is great her name's tina um toned with tina on instagram if you guys want to check her out she's great um so yeah i've been i guess you could say i've been working on myself which is good i definitely needed it but i'm excited to get back into things i finally like actually have free time to do things again and do things like my vlogs and be able to put out some content. I've been really good with my Instagram reels, but um, yeah, I also have TikToks and things. So I'll put all my things and you guys can go check me out all over the place. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to get to work. It is Monday before nine. So I need to see what my day looks like and figure out what what I'm gonna do. I've literally done so much and it's 10.22. Um, and okay, hear me out for a second. Does anyone else drink decaf coffee? Because when I'm done my one coffee, I'm like, I still want the taste of coffee. Like I wanna be sitting here sipping my coffee, but I cannot have that much caffeine because I will, just jump off of the walls or something. Um, so I think I need to buy decaf coffee. So we'll see, maybe I will get some of that. I am, I have some meetings today, which are fun. I have to do some program editing work situation. So that being said, we're coming out with a program for people who want to run an agency. So, Keep your eyes peeled for that. Keep your eyes peeled for that. Um, but yeah, I really gotta pee. But I don't want it to get up. But I'm gonna have to. I need to pee, make a smoothie. Cause I'm freaking hungry. I went to go steal a banana from my sister, but hers was less ripe than mine. So I'm just gonna deal with what I got. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Anyone else just like when they have something that doesn't really make the spoon dirty, just put it back in the drawer? Because I do. Okay, okay. So I will catch you in a jiffy. I got my bowl of cantaloupe. It's not actually cantaloupe. Um, I don't know what it is. So I ordered Instacart and they brought me this like really, really big melon and it was called something else. But it looks like cantaloupe, it tastes kind of like cantaloupe, but it's sweeter and more crunchy. If I can find the name, I'll tell you, but it's really good. I really like it. I'm just editing the course. I'm really excited for it. Really excited. Hopefully, it'll be done. All good to go. 
by like September. You know, trust. Guys, I am so snacky today. Like, I could eat a freaking horse. I don't know what it is. I think maybe I'm getting my period. Um, but yeah, all I want to do is eat. All I want to do is eat. I had some smart sweets, but I feel like they kind of make my stomach feel weird. Maybe not my stomach. It's like they leave a taste in your mouth. I don't know. Tell me if I ate the Swedish fish. Swedish fish? Is that what they're called? The fishies. The smart sweet fish. Um, let me know if that happens to anyone else, but... Man! All I want to do is eat. I'm reading... Brazen? 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 By Julia Hart from My Unorthodox Life. So good. The beginning? It's good, but it's very, like, you're learning a lot. So it almost is, like, tiring to read, if that makes sense. But now it's, like, the part where she's, like, left her community. And she's, like, starting her business. So it's, like, really, really interesting. Highly recommend. Also, if you like to read or want to read more, get a Kindle. I read so much. I finished three books in one week. Not last week, the week before. Because... Okay. Once you get one book, once you like read one fast, and it's like, oh my god, the next, the next, the next. I was reading the Colin Hoover, so good. Anyways, I'm gonna read, and then I gotta pack some stuff. Actually, no, then I'm a meeting. Then I gotta pack some stuff, and then I'm gonna bodies. So. pack some orders for Bully Bikini and here's the thing okay here is the thing where is this order you're my honey bun sugar plums from the yum to the yum she's for my sweetie pie okay let us get what we need so I've had some people ask me what is going on with Melina Bikini because we did a little I did a little hiatus for a bit I didn't post for a hot minute um I wasn't promoting it I stopped posting on the Instagram and naturally that came with people asking some questions and to be honest so what happened <laughs> is I wanted to change the, here, let me just, so I really wanted to change my manufacturer because the manufacturer that I was using is overseas and they were great, but in order to make custom suits that I actually designed, it was going to be very, very costly. So I was looking at other options, just seeing, you know, what I could find. And I did find one in Vancouver, okay? So in Vancouver, which you're thinking, okay, great, awesome, it's nice and close. So, and you know, because I would, I've had to pay for shipping overseas if I were to do an overseas manufacturer, which I have been doing, um, shipping fees are very high, as we all know. So, I went there, I was gonna get samples made, yada, yada, yada. Um, everything was all fine and dandy. But then my life kind of took a very busy turn as I had mentioned. And first off, the, the new suits from the place in Vancouver wouldn't have been ready for the summer anyways. So there wasn't really much that I could really do at that point. So my options were pretty much don't launch anything this summer, um, launch next year. And because I couldn't launch anything this summer, I kind of took a little break because it was just getting a lot, you know, running two businesses. 23 Agency is like a full-time job for me. So um, I really did not, I mean, even more than full-time, like working all the time. I was working, um, 10, 10 hours, days, 
regularly, um, sometimes up to six days a week. So it was a lot. Um, and sorry, I'm just like really concentrating on holding this <laughs> tissue paper. Um, so yes, it was a lot. And in these past months where I haven't really been working on it as much, I've honestly feel like I've came back my mental, mental, what am I trying to say right now? I gained back my, my mental health is better because I'm not stressed. I was so stressed last summer trying to run Bikini Bikini and 23 Agency. Like I went in August, I randomly like gained a ton of weight and it was all like in my stomach and my hips. My digestion was so bad because I already have digestion issues as it is. So then put on top of my extreme stress, it was honestly just not healthy. So I'm at the point where I really don't know if I want to continue, to be honest. And don't get me wrong, I still love swimwear. I love everything about the business, but I think at this point in my life, I don't know if it makes the most sense to run something that is going to give me the amount of stress that it did because running a product-based business is very, very hard. Um, don't get me wrong, the business did really well in its first few years for being so new, but it's just, you know, you kind of get to this point where it's like, okay, do I want to keep putting myself through this? I don't know. So it's kind of up in the air. I don't really know what I should do. But because I'm so indecisive and I'm not sure what I should be doing, this is great for you guys because there's a great sale right now. Um, I literally have like three, if you saw the containers I was searching through, those are, that's all that's left. So, and it's just, a lot of the sizes is um, the larger sizes. So if that's you, bonus for you, it's all up to 80% off, which is, I see. Um, but yeah, I don't know. That's kind of where I'm at. Let me know what you guys think I should do. If you have any advice, I just, I don't know. It's hard. It's hard. I feel a little lost sometimes, but that is okay. We're going to get through it. We're going to get through it. Um, but yeah, that's kind of where I'm at with Blaine Bikini, which it sucks. I, I, it, it does make me really sad. And I definitely go through moments where I'm like, yes, I love it. I want to do it so bad. But then there's other moments where I'm like, really like, it's really stressful for me. And yeah, I just, I don't know. I, I don't know. Okay, I am at Club Pilates waiting to go in. Did I even show? There we go. Um, I'm at Club Pilates waiting to go in. Um, I went to the post office and I swear every time I go, it's like they don't know what to do with the package. Like, they're like trying to measure it. I'm like, it's prepaid. Like, there's a label on it. And they don't understand. It's so weird. I miss my, I think it was Maple Ridge. I had a really good post office lady at the shoppers there. Um, but Langley, they were always super, super backed up. And then here, they just never know what they're doing. And they always try to adjust the price. I'm like, I already weighed it. I already paid for it. Why are you trying to change it? <sighs> but whatever. It's over and done with. Now I am here. I have a couple minutes to spare, which is nice. Because I thought I was going to be late. Because, oh my gosh, the like Main Street in Port Moody is always so backed up at this time of the day. But soon we will not be living by that street. So we will not be having that issue, which will be very nice. Because not a fan of traffic. Not a fan of traffic. Look who I have, little Stella Bella. Look at her, she's so big now, I swear. She gets longer every time she sleeps. She's so big, look at her. She's such a big girl. Ouchers, no, no biting. No, 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 ouch, no, 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 no. Look at her, she's so cute. But she, her nails are so sharp, but I'm so scared of cutting them, so I feel like we gotta like take her somewhere. But yeah, she's a cutie. Her and Humpy are best friends. Oh, okay. Look at her. Look at her. She's such a sweetie. Her. Boop, boop, boop. Look at that baby belly. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop.
It is, I think like 8.30, I don't even know. I'm gonna get ready for bed. I'm gonna get ready for bed. Well, actually we're gonna watch a movie. Actually, we're gonna watch a show, I think. We're watching Loki right now. We're, well, originally we were watching all of the Marvel <sighs> movies in cinematic order. So not like when they were released, but in the order of, if you know, you know. Um, anyways, so we're on Loki and honestly, it's not really that good. It's like the first thing that I'm not like, okay, this is like my cup of tea. Besides Ant-Man, I did not like Ant-Man. The second one's good, first one, mm -mm. no thank you. But yeah, so we're on Loki. I think we have like an episode and a half left, but they're pretty long episodes, I think. Um, but yeah, we're gonna finish that. And then we have, what's after that? I think What If and then WandaVision. So lots of shows and then we're back to movies, which I'm excited about. Cause I'm, I think in a movie phase right now, or like the kids would say a movie era right now. Okay, next I'm going to use the IS Clinical, IS Clinical Active Serum. I haven't used this in a hot minute. Don't know if I'm gonna restock it just because it's expensive and I feel like when I was at Lux the girl told me there's a better option. So I'll probably go ask her. I'm actually doing going through the process of like hormone testing to figure out what is going on with my body because I have had acne for gosh, I don't even know. Almost three years. Yeah, three years this summer from getting off the pill and then getting onto an IUD, which is gone, by the way. Don't recommend. Um, so yeah, just figuring that out. Plus there's like my digestion and a lot of other things, which I can get into another time because I feel like this is already going to be very long. Um, next, I'm going in with the Zio Renewal Cream. I'm really worried because I'm going away on Thursday for almost two weeks and I feel like my products are running low and I don't think a soyus or all over BC carries Zio. <laughs> um, next I'm using the Elastin Restorative Neck Complex to get rid of my neck wrinkle which I do have and this works. My wrinkle is so much less prominent and less deep. Oh my gosh, my towel is, oh my God, I'm putting it on my face. Of course, my lip sleeping mask. I literally ran out of this for like a day and a half and I almost had a full on breakdown. I'm gonna lotion up, put on some jammies and watch some TV. Somebody told her, don't create this place is in danger. No. Tell me Okay, right away then. Stella? That's not nice. Stella, go down. Go down. Guys, oh my goodness. I am editing this and I realized I didn't even film an outro. So I just want to say thank you so much for watching and come back next Wednesday for another video. You know where to find me. Make sure to check out all the socials and I'll see you later.